So the first step that you need to take is go to your settings and uh, in the system configuration section you will see that there is another section called SMS phone number configuration. Click on that and expand this box and then here uh, you would choose the state and then from the list of available phone numbers you're going to choose the one that you like, copy the phone number and paste the phone number right here and click on claim this number. So since I already have a phone number associated with this one, um, it's not going to allow me to do that. And once you claim this phone number, this exact phone number should be displayed here. And then once that is uh, there, you would click on verify phone orders. So once that step is done, the second step is go back to settings, click on app store. And on the bottom of the integration options, you're going to see there's a uh, box for SMS and click on add, give it a title, choose the phone number from the drop down menu, select the brand and the channel that you would like to receive your incoming uh, messages, text messages and click on save. So once that's done, that means you're ready to start sending and receiving your SMS. There are two ways to send SMS. One is straight from the contact profile. You will see that there's a send SMS button right here. What you would do is click on the phone number and write up your content. And click on send. So once that's done, the recipient will receive their SMS. And another way to send SMS is, of course, through the Engage feature, which is for uh, bulk messages. So what you're going to do is click on New Message, select either Auto Message or Manual Message. Uh, auto Message is something that's uh, a message that you want to send uh, continuously or some type of messages that are recurring. And the Manual Message is just for one-off engagement messages. And give this a title, click on SMS, and on the next slider, I'm gonna choose um, the message type and then I'm gonna target through the tag. I'm gonna choose the test tag and click on next, choose the phone number again, give uh, the title, and again, click um, send. So once that's done, what you can do is refresh the page and you'll be able to see the status change. As you can see here, since this was a manual SMS, just one off uh, message, so that's why the status is already sent. If it was uh, auto message, then the status would be sending. You can choose to see the activity log for this one. So this uh, message was sent to one customer only. Uh, it says it matched two customers, but the other customer actually had um, a Mongolian phone number, which is not available to be uh, sent to because currently the SMS feature is available to send and receive messages domestically. And when you connect your phone number through the App Store as an integration, as we've seen before, um, you would receive the incoming messages in this channel that you chose here.